Jillian, you got 7,000 problems. Jack-o'-lanterns ain't one of them. What do you got? Yeah, Bill. Uh, not, hey, not look, good. I tried. Okay, well, we're trying to get into the Halloween spirit here, and what is more Halloween than a jack-o'-lantern? How about 7,000 hand-carved illuminated jack-o'-lanterns displayed in things like a dinosaur, a spider web, and an aquarium? A juggling pumpkin. Now, that's where I got to go. I went to Van Cortlandt Manor in New York to their 11th annual jack-o'-lantern blaze. Whew. What? I saw things like a garden, a cemetery, Jurassic Park, and a proposal. Yeah. What do you mean a proposal? That's a proposal. Like where you asked someone to marry them? Yeah, that was a proposal. I got that. Yep. Okay. Did, did she say yes? Oh, she did say yes. Tough crowd on the yes. jack-o'-lantern story. Come on. About 130,000 people will walk through this crazy jack-o'-lantern experience. I had a chance to chat with Rob Schweitzer, the director of marketing, and he told me their sight to see this year was the constellations. We have a new element this year that I think is really cool that people are responding to, and it's the pumpkin planetarium. It's stars, it's constellations, it's on the side of you, it's above you, it's like an immersive experience. And as amazing as every scene is, uh, what really shocked me was how many pumpkins they actually use for the whole event. It's about 1,000 to 1,500 pumpkins per week throughout the run of the event that we are replacing. And so that carving work continues. Yep. It's like, these are no joke. These are not small flowers, people. How many people did it take and how long did it take to carve all those pumpkins? So they have about 12 to 15 specific carvers. That's it? And then they had 200 volunteers that scooped out a lot of the pumpkins. So just you just wouldn't even believe the attention to detail. That is a pumpkin, people. That's a Frankenstein pumpkin. A good one. Uh, it's anywhere between $16 and $25 to go. But I mean, as of right now, they're booked. They're hoping to release a few more tickets because so many people still want to come. But you've got to book early because they're swamped and they're, they, they get bigger and better every year. Look, here it comes. You can see it. <laughs> They move. They move. So it's amazing to see how much intricate work has been put in to something that's going to rot away in a couple of weeks. But uh, right. there's a lot of cool uh, pumpkins <laughs> and stuff that I've seen on the internet. Have you guys seen Donald Trumpkin yet? 374 pound pumpkin. That that's a, a pumpkin? Woman, that is a 374 pound pumpkin oh out God. of uh, Ohio. This you know, it's woman funny, Ron. makes every year. You read my mind because I was going to ask, what does the average pumpkin weigh? But now you've, you've helped yep. me. Wow. How could you not love it? You just do. You have to love it. 